All right, hey fellas, welcome back to our open form discussion. So, in the last video, we were trying to run some pimple form calculations, and we can see from this, yeah, we can see from this uh, pimple form log. Yeah, we can see from this pimple form log, it's gonna take pretty long time per time step, just to, yeah. You can see the delta t is as such 0 0.17 okay 0 0.17 even at a coron number of 2 and yeah the coron number of 2 and it takes approximately uh, 40 seconds for each time step to run so there's 55063 here Okay, 5063 here, 5412 here. Okay, so 19 iterations. So before that, 5063. So approximately, approximately, let's see, approximately takes uh, one minute, 5063, about 50, 50, 60 seconds per 0 0.17 seconds here we do a simple calculation all right we have 1000 seconds of simulated time and we want to see how long it will take in the real time so you'll take about 60 seconds per 0 0.17 seconds and that will be 350,000 seconds divide by number of hours or divide by 3600 to find how many hours we need we need we need yeah we need about 100 hours which is easily about four days of calculation so this thing is not going to finish anytime soon so remember the last uh, few videos we were talking about changing the control dictionary in the middle of uh, the thing running right so vi control dictionary remember we are talking about runtime modifiable equals true so uh, yes yeah so runtime modifiable true means you can the what open form will do is that it will ch keep reading the the dictionaries for example control dictionary at least according to this uh, according to uh, open form here so runtime modifiable switch for weather dictionaries for example control dictionary are reread at the simulation at the beginning of each time step allowing the user to modify the parameters of the simulation so since we have this runtime modifiable equals true we can actually change this maximum corons number to more than two that is one but that's kind of a trivial thing to do uh, uh, we want to see we want to see of course whether we can change our pimple form settings in the middle of our simulation okay so I mean of course we can change the coron number from 2 to 3 for example but we don't uh, exactly want to do that I mean that is kind of a trivial change the more interesting thing is to see whether we can adjust every solution every solution because maybe the tolerance is too high uh, tolerance is too low rather so that uh, you know the yeah you know the the uh, velocity I mean it it takes too long to converge in other words so if we were to change a little bit of our um, tolerances hopefully it will be able to converge faster so let's change this let's say to 1 times 10 to the minus 3 and this two orders of magnitude up 10 to the minus 2 that's a residual control and then we'll save and quit see what changes we have on the pimple form so let's see log dot pimple form Hopefully it takes us less time 
in the following time steps to um, actually converge. So this is uh, take note 5433. Okay, hopefully the next time step will be allowing for like more time and stuff. So Five, four, three, three. Okay, I'm gonna take a break again and see where this is going. <clears throat> yeah, so five, four, three, three seconds. A few minutes later, we can see this. Okay, I'm gonna scroll through all the pimple form iterations. So pimple iteration fifteen, iteration sixteen. So I'm going to scroll through till the nineteenth, and then the thing converges. Uh, so solving pimple convergent 19 iterations 5433 3, 5497 it's about a minute so look at this one we say that from function virtual boolean form region ij object this is a c plus plus thing again so it's uh since i changed every solution halfway during the simulation uh they they're going to uh, change some of the settings so this is interesting you can change the pimple form settings halfway so at uh, delta t equals this much, uh, time equals to 11 seconds. Let's see how many uh, iterations it takes now. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, so 5530, five, it takes about 9 iterations now, approximately half the time. So 5530 five, seconds over here, 5530 five, seconds. And 5497. So I basically uh, half the time um, by setting a lower, you know, lower uh, convergence uh, criteria. And the other thing we can try, okay, the other thing we can try is to, again, uh, we can actually change um, every solution and looks like um, this actually works residual control actually works i can also change the non-orthogonal characters back to one and characters back to one so um, that should help speed up the solution significantly since we are running the inner loop once instead of um, like five times. I mean, once for non orthogonal, one for correctors. So hopefully, this will, uh, yeah, this will, um, yeah, this will uh, cause the simulation to run faster. So let's take a look at, uh, let's take a look at log dot pimple form. So let's see whether we have a rereading of the. There should be a rereading of every solution. Yep, so every solution is reread again. So you can see the difference between, let's say, this one. We have this pimple iteration, nice smooth solver solving UX, blah, 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 blah. So it solves many, many times of the in inner uh, what do you call that inner uh, inner uh, inner loop okay it solves many times of the inner loop and now it solves for much less you see between each pimple iteration there's going to be uh, much less uh, uh, time and let's see what's the what's the time step saving so 5816 right 5816 of clock time and you can see the log pimple form again. 5816 was our last check mark. Okay, 5816. You can see the new time step. See, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay. 5816, 5833. So again, we have converged in like 10 iterations. And uh, now we, instead of 5816, we have 5833 uh, seconds. So that's about 
33 minus 5, 8, 1, 6. 17 seconds per iteration. So going at this rate, going at this rate, the simulation should take about, yeah, like one day to finish. So, uh, yeah, we can see, we can kind of fiddle around, play around with uh, this to see, uh, okay, uh, based on the convergence criteria, we can alter it. Um, yeah, based on the convergence criteria and based on, you know, what's the, what is the, uh, yeah, the loop. We can we can change certain things in FV solution to try and make things run faster or slower during the uh, during the course of the uh, iterations itself, so that uh, we we can you know test for test for uh, stability, test for uh, speed on the fly. So this is very one thing very uh, interesting about um, uh, using this uh, runtime modifiable. Uh, step runtime modifiable so it allows allows you to change the every solutions everything halfway during your simulation and yeah open form will read it as you change it uh, if you get an error too bad you got to you got to redo some things or else it's going to uh, sometimes help it run faster or slower depending on what you you want to do so this is a very useful thing a useful tool for you to know so yeah, you can even change the Quran number halfway so that uh, it will run even faster. You can change the Quran number to 5, for example. So let's see if we can change the Quran number to 5 or 10. You, let's push the limit. Uh, control dictionary. Let's change the Quran number to 10. Okay. So every every seventeen seconds, remember we there should be oops sorry, vi lock, pimple foam. So if we change the Quran number to ten, the the time step should increase every uh, every so often. Okay, so now it's like six oh four eight. So now it changes the control dictionary. So we have changed control dictionary a bit. To allow for increased Quran's number. Okay, so let's see. So that's where we are. Pimple iteration 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So 10 iterations. So we are increasing Quran number pretty drastically. Again, 1, iteration 1, iteration 2, iteration 3, so on and so forth. So it takes about 10 pimple iterations to uh, get the, the next time step, yeah? So iteration 9 and 10, it should converge thereabout. And now you're, you're increasing the Quran number to 3. So it still, it still, um, it still looks okay. Uh, the residuals are pretty small, which is good news. So, okay, this, this simulation should speed up significantly now. So 6100 for delta t of 0 0.35, 6100, so I'm just going to estimate the time again, 6083, so it's uh, 17 uh, seconds, okay, still at 17 seconds for 10 iterations, and instead of 0 0.17, now we have 0 0.35, so we have cut down the simulation time by half, so simply by increasing Courant number. Uh, the maximum Quran number allowable. So let's see. Okay, let's see whether the Quran number has increased to 10. So it's at about uh, 6 or 7 now. Um, 6, 1, 7, 4 seconds and it still converges in about 10 or 11 iterations, which is perfectly all right. Perfectly all right. So we can see, at least in our case, that uh, increasing the number of inner loops doesn't really help with the convergence or timing as much. So sometimes reducing it to a low number, let's say one instead of three, it will help with the, the, the simulation 
uh, efficiency and the computation efficiency. So, yeah, now you can see delta T is 0 0.591, 6155 here, and 6174 here. So, 6155 minus 6174. 6155 minus 6174 it's about 19 seconds 19 seconds so it's 20 seconds per 0 0.59 uh, uh, just 0 0.677 but uh, 0 0.59 is here okay so give an estimate about 20 seconds so increasing the current number now uh, we have uh, reduced the simulation time even further to about 9 hours here. So these are just some, yeah, some things you can tweak. Very useful. And now the current number is about 10. Which is uh, yeah, pretty steady, steady for us. Delta T is almost 1 second here. Which uh, is much faster than we had before. Uh, at least it should make this uh, simulation complete within a relatively uh, sh a much shorter amount of time. So, but we change. You have to note we change the algorithm kind of halfway through the whole thing. Okay. So, at least in this video, it shows you how um, runtime modifiable is uh, good. Okay. Uh, we can change the FV solutions. We can change the control dictionary halfway as pin perform is running so that uh, you can speed up slow down do all the kind of stuff very useful uh, to know okay so thanks for watching i'll see you guys again bye bye